telling you a radical. Add them up. Up and at them. Up and at them. So I'm leaving for California in the morning. I'll be working the coast. You know, probably start in Northern Cal. Head south. So I'm going to have to rent a car. It's expensive. I want to buy one, you know. So, hey, you out there on the road always doing what you're told. Can you help me? It, it you know, it's staggering to me. The marine biologists, the academias, the fucking media, everybody's caught up in this fucking fairy tale fucking right wing conspiracy shit, left wing conspiracy shit, when Fukushima is the most obvious thing in the fucking history of mankind. It's obvious the scars across my face. 50 million fainting goats in California. Nobody can do the tide pool fucking work. I don't know. We're going to get full moon, plus, we're going to get. For the first time in years, we're going to get an actual normal hour where they're low. You know, you know I'm not going to have to be up at four in the morning or freaking. Well, well, we'll see. But so this historic, important PhD, this work, it's that important. It's that historic. Thank you, everybody, for supporting. So the bomb's 75 years old this week, you know, this month. You know, so, oh, no, that's no biggie deal. We're all caught up in fuck what do you think COVID-19 is you, you tell me coronavirus has not changed your life you tell me post Fukushima this epic acute heat wave that's annihilated the western United States I'm telling you what it's done here fuck all the trees are fucking dead all over the western United States I mean it's the Great Salt Lake's gone fucking dry I mean it's an epic fucking hot plasma gas and you know, now they come out, 10 fucking years later, the Stanford professor, ha, 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 it's almost 10 years, but we're just getting started studying. For, fuck you. Kevin Weitz has been doing the fucking work on this from day one. Uh, it's just fucking YouTube. <laughs> it's just the will. It's just fucking fire. You know, and I want people to understand my methods. Oh, there's a fucking method behind my madness. I knew off the get, I knew that I had to hold retention in the YouTube genre. You know, I'm an old communications professor. I know what the fuck I'm doing. The artist, the butcher, the baker, the candlestick maker, Kevin Blanche, wearing all these fucking hats. I knew that in, I had to get placed in the top of the search engine. I know to do that was based on retention in those days. In the great organic fucking world of YouTube, you should be based on retention. Not on view count, not on clickbait, not on... not cable TV like it is now. How did they do it? How did they social engineer your freaks into fucking all this? God's gay's guns, God's gay's gun, fucking, you know, baby fucking blood drinkers, all this freak show. Made up shit. How did they do it? One by Jetstream, two by cable TV. Operation Foxconn run right out of the house of Windsor. Fucking, and you fall for it because the ignorant have been fucking inherited the earth. So, corruption, oh, it's okay. White collar crime, oh, it's okay. Fuck, go give your money to Greenpeace. Go give it to Sierra Club. Go give it to fucking whatever you fuck. And I want to say to this to Jerry up there in uh, Washington. Take your fucking money and choke on it. Fucking inherits a bunch of money. I says, well, well fucking loan me $5,000. Fucking make fuck. Uh, you know, maybe you can fucking pray over it while you fucking, when you go to fucking die. I mean, it's pathetic to me. It's pathetic all these people fucking grasping to their fucking money. Is they go down. What are you going to do? Live to be 100? It's fucking me. I mean, it's a joke. It truly is. They, the people that have supported this show, thank you. You know, but i never seen a bunch of selfish 70-year-old fucks in my life. You know, so, like I said, the people that have supported this short work, that's the beauty of this GoFundMe page. There it is, right there for God and everybody to fucking see. Transparent on Balco and Chemo. You know, thank you, Colette. Thank you. Yo, Dana, thank you, everybody, you know? <sighs> Fuck. Full-time job? Fuck, are you kidding? This is 50 full-time jobs. I've done the work of hundreds of fucking guys. Fucking. Never seen a selfish bunch of fucking freaks in my fucking life. It's disgusting. So, if we can, get the tide pool work fucking done, Kevin. Oh, I'm done. I was standing right here, fuck, when I got sick. It's your pseudo de facto theology. It's your pseudo de facto sociology. Jesus coming back. I hope he wears a fucking mask. I wish he'd hurry the fuck up.
you know, this whole fucking fairy tale is in the earth. It's caught up in, it's the bio, oh, it's your biology. It's the ecology, stupid. Literal, literal. Think about it. Think about it. <laughs> uh, I mean, COVID-19, co mutation from the sea. It's that obvious. It's obvious. All this. Folks go, oh, now we find a plutonium. It was plutonium in the cores when Kevin White was screaming that fucking day one. You know, oh, no, it's all coincidence type who just epically collapsed. Oh, they're coming back. They're coming back. Yeah, like Jesus. Yeah, right. Okay. Starvation well event. Salmon epically. The Copper River fucking salmon number is going to be over in a couple of days. It's going to be at less than 500,000. They're on the right at 500,000. Just a hair over 500. Oh, from 4 million? That's nothing. That's nothing. Longevity in lifespans in the United States was going like this. We have open heart surgery, which I had. We have organ transplant. I mean, I had ML leukemia fucking. Never had the transplant, remember? This is important. I was too sick. Sent me home to die, so I've had that wolf right on my neck the whole time. You know, I fight for her. She fights for me. The mighty blue lady. She's protecting me. You know, the wolves and the trolls, my own government hives. No protection, no lawyer, fucking no nobody. You know, yeah, John Steinbeck, you're ever in need. Don't go to the rich people, go to the poor. They're the only ones to help, the only ones. Go ahead, sir, I'm about going chemo. So I'll be on Cannery Row here next couple days, I think. You know, we'll see how this goes. You know, I need a car. <laughs> Fuck all the money everybody's got out there and, you know, whatever, and they're just going to. Fucking hunker down. We need it. Got to protect it. You know, I'm 70. I'm going to live to be 100. Okay, maybe you buy yourself diapers. Pathetic, actually. You know, so much good we could have done. Well, which, which we have done. You know, thank you. Everybody has historic, historic work. You know, if I don't do it, it does not get done, which is staggering to me. Nobody knows tide pools up and down California like me. Nobody. Every single one. The tide pool work that I've done at historic low tide. You know how hard that is? And by the way, I don't get in tide pools. No, I'm a tide pool jumper, which is very, very difficult. And oh, I'm athletic. You know, try me. Try me. And so I skim across those like a shorebird. At historic low tides. You know how much work I put into that? Oh, I'll blow your fucking mind. It's, it's incredible historical documentation. Tide's going to look back and say, whoa, wow, look at these. At the best tide pools in the world, Point Loma, freaking PB Point, fucking La Jolla, fucking Monterey, all of them. You know, every great fucking tide pool there is. The I know the best tide pools in all of California. I go right to them, you know, at historic low tide. Uh, and it's not just about full moon cycles. It's about the wind flow. It's about all of it. And it's been difficult. It's been hard, you know. So, Carmel Cove, I mean, whoa. What a tight pool that is. That's a tough one to get in, by the way. Really tough one to get in. Sit there, I remember, wait, wait, and go. You know, remember I did most of that with a failed orc valve. Most of it while I'm in critical condition. Remember, I was attacked by trolls hired by the Nuclear Crime Syndicate, the Department of Energy, troll, while in critical condition. My family inheritance was robbed from me while in I was attacked by a county commissioner here. You know, Weber County employee, the state of Utah, while I'm in critical condition. I don't think people realize the status of my health during this whole thing. I have AML de nouveau non hoxins with the survival rates less than 1%. I've been in critical condition the whole fucking time. You don't believe me? Go talk to Vincent Hansen. Go talk to Kimbo Peterson. Go talk to him. Go ask him. They'll tell you straight up, Kevin Lance is the biggest miracle. Kevin, I don't know what you do. Whatever you do, you keep fucking doing it. You blow my mind. I don't know how the hell you've done this. How you're alive, well, I am. Again, I fight for her. She fights for me. To see the mighty boo it's the ecology stupid so i keep doing it and i'm tired of living in poverty but you know i get by with a little help from my friends so stand tuned thank you for everyone you know we're a team we are family so You're back on me, fucking run me, because you're political. Well, run along, fucking run along. Leave me the fuck alone. You know, I really don't give a fuck about view count. I could care less about that. You know, this is our small, tiny fucking army. You know, it's not about quantity, it's about quality. You know, so it's just, how about that work out there? At the, oh, no, that doesn't matter. Up and at them. 
What do you think fucking COVID-19 is? What do you think all the security? Oh, it's nuclear. Jeff Bezos fucking grandpappy. Los Alamos, hell of a way to fucking boil water, fucking Albert. So, only took him 75 years, these fucking monsters. Stay in tune.